As of tonight, there are nearly 700 cases of missing children in the state of Ohio. That's according to the state attorney general's office. One of those missing children is now 14 year old Arthur Lowry. The teenager from the west side of Columbus was last seen after his football game nine days ago. 10 TV's Carla Rogner speaking with his family this afternoon about the challenges of bringing a runaway home. Yeah, Colin, Arthur Lowry had just started his freshman year at West High School and just joined the football team. When his family said they found out he was lying about skipping practice, they got into a fight and he ran away. Now they're feeling helpless as they try to find a way to bring him home. It's not safe for a 14 year old to be out on the street. On the west side of Columbus, Karen Litchington has been searching for her grandson Arthur. His aunt Des Corset has been helping too, placing posters all along Hague Avenue, only to find they've been taken down. It's been nine days since they saw the 14 year old boy. So do you think he's in harm's way? I do. I, I think that he's in the drugs and whatever else that these kids are doing. And he's not used to that. He has a curfew. Karen Litchington has custody of her grandson. They got into a fight after his football game last Friday night. And no one has heard from him since. I've had Arthur since he was four turning five. Matter of fact, September 1st was his 10 years anniversary with us. Mm -hmm. His grandpa's birthday and he never even called his grandpa. Last year in Ohio, the state attorney general's office reported more than 17,000 children went missing. 98% of them were reunited with their families. Close to 10,000 of those children were considered runaways. This summer, Columbus police have asked parents to be responsible for their children and encourage them to stay on the right track. Litchington says it's hard to keep him out of trouble when they don't even know where he is. Oh, it's really hard to be responsible for one. The detective said, well, you probably think your child's innocent and he ain't. My child ain't innocent. I know what he's capable of. I know this is not in his behavior. Arthur's family doesn't know what to do next. They're hoping he'll decide to come home on his own. So what do you do now? I just keep waiting. Yeah, Columbus police told us today that Lowry is still missing. They did not have any updates on his case. Colin.